This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PICAT says, what is the volume of a right circular cylinder that has a radius of five units and a height of six units? So again, on the ASVAB and PICAT, you're not permitted to use a reference sheet or a calculator. So for that reason, you have to commit these formulas to memory. Thankfully enough, this one's pretty simple to derive as long as you know how to find the area of a circle. And let's talk about that for a second. So first of all, what does a right circular cylinder look like? It's a circular face that is connected to another circular face like so. In other words, uh, what we're going to do to find its volume is we're going to find the area of one of its circular faces. And again, this is the radius of this circular face. Let's find the area of this circular face. The area of a circle is pi r squared. And what we're going to do is multiply that circular face's area by the height of the cylinder. And just like that, we derive the formula to find the volume of right circular cylinder. So all we have to do is identify these values from the problem and plug them in accordingly. We know this radius, our r is 5, and its height is 6. So let's plug this in accordingly. This becomes pi 5 squared times 6. Uh, this becomes pi 5 squared is 5 times 5, r 25 times 6. 25 times 4 would, of course, be 100. 25 times 5 would be 125. 25 times 6 is 150. So the volume, in other words, of this right circular cylinder is C 150 pi. Again, as long as you can find the area of a circle, you should be able to find the volume of a right circular cylinder very easily.